The year 2022 is coming to an end and it's not clear which software to jump into because 2023 is coming soon and the developers are preparing major updates. So what editing software to download today and whether you should switch to another program now? Today we collected for you top editing apps relevant in both 2022 and 2023. My name is Arthur Weiner, this is the Mobile Vlog and here we go. OpenShot is the first app on the list. This is a free open source editing program that is ideal for beginners. It has a simple interface that doesn't take a long time to figure out. And the overall process of learning to edit in this program is very short. Literally grab the files, drag and drop them into the app and edit. There is lots of stuff here, including transitions, audio and video effects to enhance your videos. What's great is that there are no limits on the number of layers and the final resolution of the video so you can render up to 4K. And the cool thing is that it's completely free without any extra fees to unlock the full functionality. The interface is really simple and intuitive. To add clips to the timeline, you need to click on project files, select the desired files on your computer and drag and drop into this window. Next, you select the files and drag and drop them onto the timeline. To add a transition between shots, click on the transitions button and you will see a whole list of transitions and there are quite a few. Transitions are thrown onto the timeline just like other files and to make the transition go faster, just drag the beginning or the end of the transition, then drag it down on the clip and let's see the result. One and perhaps a serious drawback of this program is that it can be slow on computers with weak specs. But if you have a good computer, you can download it right now either on Windows or Mac. And yes, this program is still relevant and will be relevant in 2023. Let's move on to the next program, Mobavi Video Editor Plus. It's good for both beginners and advanced users who don't need super advanced editing features, but want to quickly and easily edit a good video. But even better is that here you can not only edit videos, but also convert footage to the required format and record the screen if necessary. And yes, there is even a photo editor. All this functionality is available in one accessible and intuitive platform, Movavi Unlimited. It's not free, but if access to full functionality, guaranteed tech support and regular updates are important to you as a user, you can get it all at a secret Movavi sale at an 85% discount. This includes nine programs and a one year unlimited access to the effects store for the price of one application. And perhaps best of all, an average PC is enough to run the platform. The editor itself has a simple and straightforward interface for essentially anyone who is not familiar with the editing process. Creativity in this program is available to everyone. You load your footage into this window, then drag and drop it onto the timeline one by one in the order you want. And the best part starts in the panel on the left. There are several sections, filters, transitions, titles, stickers, and additional tools. Each section has a lot of different templates that will help speed up and improve the editing process. That is, in general, it is a quick import of clips into the project, quick use of effects, presets and smart tools, ready solutions for editing in a few clicks. Additional tools include more flexible color correction, shaky frame stabilization, simple animation, chroma key removal, and many other basic features. Videos can be exported in many different formats, including instant posting to some social networks, including if you're just starting to edit your videos for your YouTube channel, the functionality of Movavi will definitely suit you. In fact, the main thing is to start and you can learn how to work with the platform as you go along because this product is designed for both beginners and more advanced users. And I remind you that the Movavi Unlimited Annual Plan is available at 85% discount on a special secret page. Click the link below to take advantage of this secret offer. The next program on the list is HitFilm Express. This functional free editor is more suitable for those who want to dive even deeper into editing because here you will find advanced tools for creating obviously advanced projects. And of course, there is support for 4K video, more than 400 effects and presets, advanced cutting tools and filters both for video and audio are available for free. You also get the ability to make motion tracking and animations with special tools. When exporting a project, almost all popular file formats are available, but the program is not completely free. If you outgrow the free features and want even more, you can buy more than 30 
30 bundles with additional effects, presets, transitions, and so on. Of the major drawbacks, it's the whole quest they make before you install the program on your computer. You'll have to create an account, click on the download button, then you will be offered some paid options, but if you don't need them, this is the slider you need to move to the very beginning. Now you need to fill out the form and click on get download link. And only then you can install the program. But the program itself is cool and functional and they give over 100 free tutorials on how to use this program. And yes, not all computers will handle this program. So make sure your computer is suitable before downloading. The video editor is available on both Windows and Mac OS and the team is developing this software so it will be quite relevant to work in it in 2023. Next is Lightworks. This is a fairly easy program to edit even though famous movies like Wolf of Wall Street and Pulp Fiction have been edited in it. Runs quickly, previews and edits are generally pretty smooth. There are lots of tools to organize, process and export your footage. It looks beautiful at first glance but let's see what's inside. The editing process here may seem unfamiliar, but becomes quite intuitive over time. The free version will suit all beginners to get acquainted with the wide range of functionality that comes with editing at all. Of course, these features are simplified in the free version and don't give much flexibility. This is just enough to understand the point, poke and try, to form a general idea of the editing process. There are cool tools for color correction here, advanced level, even in the free version. And unfortunately, you cannot output video in all formats and set the resolution above 720p. A shame and a pity because in 2022, no one puts out with such a resolution. The pro version, on the other hand, has a lot of formats and resolutions. All this makes the free Lightworks a good option for all beginners. Nevertheless, I wouldn't stick with this program for long. It's okay for starters, but then you'll probably want to switch to something else. The pro version is good for big projects. I wouldn't edit social media content here. The program is available on Mac, on Windows, and it's never too late to try the free version, especially if you are a beginner. And of course, the bonuses. Blender, a great free program where you can not only edit 4K video, but also make 3D. I would even say, on the contrary, this program is specifically for creating 3D. And grab the program called Shotcut. This program program is absolutely free, it has no pro versions or anything like that. However, compared to Lightworks, making animations here is a little easier. You get the three classic color wheels and other tools for color correction. However, Shotcut doesn't handle 4K video very well. It's a good option to start with, but no more than that. And a program that is very relevant now and will be in 2023 is DaVinci Resolve 18. This is probably one of the best free software for video editing. Can you believe it? It's still free. They also have a paid version that includes more advanced features, but if you're editing a video for your blog, the basic functionality will be enough. The paid version includes more effects, templates, and more export options. I would say that if you are a professional, sooner or later you will definitely want to buy the pro version. It has a lot of features and the main advantage over other programs, in my opinion, is the lower sections. You can switch between them very quickly without any delay. In simple terms, each section focuses the same timeline on a different task. Some were cutting, some were editing, some were effects, some were working with sound. In the case of Adobe, you need to download multiple programs for one task or another. If you need editing, download Premiere. If you need sound processing, download Audition. If you need effects, download After Effects. With DaVinci, everything is in one program, which is very convenient. At first glance, from the point of view of a beginner, the interface resembles a spaceship interface where it's not immediately clear what is needed. Despite the fact that it looks confusing, it has a nice design, and after a few weeks of solid training, you will feel very comfortable. It will probably take you two or three weeks to learn the program, but it will be worth it in the end. The interface itself is divided into six sections. Media, where you import and sort footage. Cut, where you do the quick cuts. Edit, where you build the project. Fusion, 2D and 3D effects for video compositing. Of course, color, where you can do your color correction. 
Fairlite, where you manipulate the audio and deliver where you export your project. DaVinci also supports 8K video, but in the Pro version. However, if you plan to edit videos only for YouTube or short videos for social media, then I would not advise to start with this program. Because it's very confusing and learning how to edit will take you a really long time. Still, if you are serious about video production and want to build your career on it, even if you are starting out, I would advise allocating time to learning how to edit in this program. A lot of professional editors are now favoring DaVinci. It goes on Windows and on Mac, especially on Mac because they have adopted the software very well for the new M1 and M2 processors, which you can't say about Premiere Pro, for example. Whew. I hope we help you make the right choice in search for editing software. But in the meantime, check out these videos to learn even more about video editing. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.